Former Collector Con Funko announcements have started. Funko Box of Fun winners can't wait to purchase their boxes. This and many more pops and sodas were announced this week. I'm Ricardo, also known as the Pop Patrol. Just in case you're wondering what Walmart Collector Con is, this is a convention that Walmart has decided to have of their own every year for three times per year. Now, as of this video release, here are all the Funko items that they've announced so far. Now, they're releasing an exclusive four-pack Deadpool. These all had their individual pops released earlier this year, but in case you didn't grab any and you may still want them all together, they also have an exclusive 1992 10-inch Jordan Funko Pop, an exclusive 10-inch Michelangelo with Donuts Funko Pop, and from the Masters of Universe Walmart exclusives, we have a Masters of the Universe coin bag, a Masters of the Universe She-Ra on Swiftwind, and a four-piece enamel pin set. And also from the new What If line of Funko Pops, we have Party Thor, which is an awesome looking pop in my opinion. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of this Thor. Now onto Funko Box of Fun for winners who were announced on July 20th. Funko also released tons of additional information about boxes and items within the boxes. Now each box is themed to one of the four teams competing in Fun Day games. Funko Force, Pop Rangers, Protopunks, and Fanatic Fury. Each team will have seven exclusive items relating to the teams they choose. You will have a team pop, bandana, Thunder Sticks pin, Pop Team Mascot, Black and Gold Podium, and a Pop 2-pack of Brian Mariotti and Mike Becker. You also have three mystery exclusive Pops which will, however, arrive later. To reiterate, your shipment will arrive in two parts. The first part of your box of fun shipment will arrive in time for you to represent your team on the Fun Days events August 6th. The second part of your shipment, which includes the limited edition surprise Funko Pop vinyl figures, will arrive after Fun Days. Now some more additional information for the winners. Emails were already sent out on how to participate. Instructions will look something like this, but your times and dates may differ. A few things to note, you'll receive an email five minutes before the time slot that was given to you. And you should get your password and a link for the Funko Box of Fun items. Now you cannot go to Funko.com, you have to use this link. Once you begin shopping at checkout, you must use the email that you enter the lottery with. There's a limit of one box per order and express pay options are not available. Hey, before we continue, if you enjoy this video so far and you appreciate it, please hit that like button. I'd be super happy if you did so, as well as it helps this video out and the channel out. Thank you. Now moving on from all the con announcements, for pre-orders this week, we had the PX Preview exclusive, The Simpson Glowing Mr. Burns Pop. There are actually two versions of this glow in the dark pop where the Chase version actually has him entirely glowing. Does that make sense? His entire body glows. You know what I mean. Also, you have the regular one with him in his pajamas and only a specific portion of him glows. New Space Jam Pops also got announced this week. We have Bugs Dribbling. We have the Bro, Metallic AI with Pete. We have another LeBron James Pop, another LeBron James Pop. Pop in the Box exclusive flocked Gossamer Funko Pop. I don't know if I said his name correct. If I didn't, let me know in the comments down below. Scream at me, shout at me something. And for some of the pops that should be available now, we have from GameStop, the fourth piece GameStop exclusive Bounty Hunter lineup. We have four Lam, which is absolutely now available. Blizzard also announced an exclusive Nano Cola Diva with Mecha Funko Pop. It also comes with a Blizzard 30 sticker. If you were interested in the What If Pop line and you did not yet purchase any, you have an opportunity to purchase them now as Amazon has them on sale. 
And for some Funko Pops that are coming soon, we had an out of box look at three. Up first for My Hero Academia, we have the new Bakugo. This pop actually is very similar to the SDCC pop from 2020, but has a few little differences. Let me know if you prefer this one or the one before, or you'll just be getting both. Continued anime from One Piece, we have Shanks, who also has a chase, who looks a little bit similar to the original common, but with enough differences for you to actually 100% want to call it both. And we also had an out of box look at the new Jack in the Box Funko Pop. If you're interested in seeing a review and unboxing of this particular pop, Top Pops did one on his YouTube channel. By all means, go and support and watch it as well. Now onto Funko Sodas. There were a great many Funko Sodas released and announced this week. We had Naruto Shippuden. We have Disney Villains Maleficent. From Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, we have Casey Jones. We also had Mr. Monopoly, Metal Beast Boy, Kirito, and Neon Rat Fink. And all, of course, have chases. As usual, let me know in the comments down below what you're most excited for. For more Funko news, Funko reviews and unboxings, don't forget to hit the like as well as the subscribe and make appreciate it if you did. Bye for now.